Let's hop right into it, man. Raven is legal, even though she only came out yesterday. I feel like the character is pretty fair, at least right now. The character's not overpowered, not too crazy, and Shiro's Raven is cr pretty, pretty good, man. I played Shiro a number of times earlier, and Shiro kicked my ass. And I feel like my Raven's really good, but Shiro was a beating my ass with the Raven. So we got Raven versus Morty. This should be a fun matchup right now. I'm really excited. This is the first time I've seen this matchup, and I'm sure that's the case for most of y'all as well. Definitely interesting. Raven does have a few tools to negate Morty's projectiles and projectile of her own. So it's going to be interesting to see how those different tools match up against each other in this matchup. Matchup oh, against the matchup. W commentating. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. Morty versus Raven. First yes. time we've seen it in tourney. Absolutely, we got the Raven out here and let's see how it goes. I'll tell you what, we're in for a long set. Um, Raven versus Zoners can take a while because Raven doesn't really have the best approach options and neither does Morty. Um, but right now we are scrapping a slight lead for Shiro, um, but not something that uh, Morty and Gorify cannot make up. Seeing a lot of Nair from Shiro so far. Nair into up air is a really good option, and Nair into fair. Definitely one of her best tools. We got the Raven set up and immediately destroyed from Gorify. Well done to get that Raven gone, get Lenore out of here. Nair into fair, sending Gorify off stage. Let's see. It's really difficult right now for Gorify to get a hit. Wow, parrying this, this light laser right there. And the parry in response from Gorify, not quite able to get the combo he was hoping for, but still not bad for Gorify. Shiro taking the first stock right there. Well done with that up air. Shiro displaying very good understanding of the character considering they only came out yesterday. Somebody Confident needs to, uh, to play her in tournament. Somebody needs to break the bad news to Morty. He said, I hope I'm not in a tournament right now, dude. Nobody tell him, like, he fucking yeah, is. Yeah, don't and let him know. That's actually one of my favorite voice lines from Morty. The other one being, whatever character just rung me out needs to be nerfed. Absolutely. Absolutely. Morty definitely having the better voice lines in the cast. I uh, 100% agree. Big fan of what he's got to do, or he has. Shiro, good use of the float as well. Good use of the side special right there into the fair. Going for the up special. In burnout, floating away. Can Gorify get the kill? Getting the laser into dash deck. That will do it. Evening up the stocks, 59% on this Morty. Great little bit of extra credit for Shiro gain here. And uh, utilizing that float pretty well. So the really, really good tool for Raven and really helps the character. Um, really, as well, that and the movement makes her movement options really, really good. Bit of a scramble right now. Both players just pressing buttons, man. Getting the damage racked up. A little bit of a lead for Shiro, but not something that Gorify can't make up. There we go. Good at damage right now for Gorify. And the bomb, not Ooh. quite able to get that. Oh, the Lenore combos. Wow. Nair into up air. Very big uh, tool that we see a lot of Ravens doing nowadays. But uh, as time goes on, I'm sure they will find some saucy tech. We did see something on Twitter from Psyche. Uh, yeah. Very interesting. Zero I, to death. I was really hoping Psyche would compete in this tournament. That's a player that I want more than anybody to compete in this tournament. So I'm going to work. And there it is, Gorify, by the way. At evening it up. Basically even game right now. Um, let's, let's finish this game before talking about Psyche, though I do want him to compete in a Shifty Showdown one of these weeks because he is arguably the best player in the world. And we got the Lenore combos right there from Shiro. I'd love to see that. It's the coolest part about this character. Raven is her ability to combo with Lenore. We got Gorify racking up the damage. This is as even as it gets right here. Ooh, big combo out of Grenade, but unfortunately not able to keep it going. All right. Very, very even 20% lead for Gorify. Going for the side special, not able to get it right now. Right, Nair into up tilt, not able to do it. Another Nair. All right, big damage for Gorify. And once Raven hits that 100%, we are going to have Rage activate. And just like that, we have Enraged Raven right now. Getting Lenore, not quite able to get the up air though. 
getting a fair, and oh my god, he almost died at 70 because of the rage mode, and that will do it. Nair into up air. We'll take game one for Shiro gone. Wow, it's interesting how they removed Weaken, but give it to the one character that they released. <laughs> yeah, it very, is. Very, very Warner Brothers of them. Crazy, crazy, crazy mechanic. Make somebody else leader? Absolutely, if you guys want to switch. Um... If you want to change maps, you could ban in uh, in chat if you want to do that, or if you're just hoping that that uh, if that helps. That's, um, that's gonna be a W raid from Costi with 42 billion. Appreciate that, my boy. I hope you enjoy these tournament games. Absolutely, man. Thank you for the raid, Costi. Much appreciated, man. Welcome everybody to Swifty Showdown, the first tournament of season four, and we got. Um, we got the Raven out here on Shirogon, man. Looking really, really good. The difference just being the Rage mode, though, like, the damage was so even the whole way, but Raven just able to get the kill so much earlier. Morty really, really struggles when it comes to getting the kill. Okay, it looks like something, I don't know if Glorify is struggling with lag, but from the start, it looked like he was not really... Um, trying to play. Maybe we want to reset the lobby if Glorify can let us know what's going on. Um, can't use your moves. Yeah, I guess we could try restarting the lobby if you want. Or you want to try running it back and well, see if it fixes. He did opt to run it back. If this doesn't work as well, then yeah, we will restart the lobby real quick. And, uh, Glorify, you can invite us. But hopefully this will fix it. Show them what we got. We will see if hopefully things work out, man. Wow, and big upset, I gotta say. Karma is on the Rick beating Flococo. Huge upset right there, man. Alright, and looks like we are into this game too, though. Gorify is good to go. I wish we would have gotten that on stream. Congrats, Karma. We definitely gotta get you on stream, man. Versus the winner of Uka Legend and Gritaku. We'll definitely get that. Alright, either way though, this game right now looking better for Gorify. That's there being a great tool considering oh that it is multi hit and has considerable knockback. That's gonna be sure with the early stock on Gore. Absolutely. Looking good for Shiro, man. That kill power is no joke with. Raven, Saren, Glorify really going deep for that one. He needs to with the Morty. Going for the grenade. Shiro playing around it. Going for Dare. Doing everything he can right now. Putting himself in a bad spot as well. By putting himself in burnout. Let's see if Shiro can capitalize. Unfortunately, going to be really tough for most characters to chase Raven. Considering she does have the Black Adam floatiness. Shiro is at 100, meaning Rage does come out, but they don't seem to be able to capitalize on it. Glorify getting that stock and continuing. Evening the damage. Do not count Glorify out just yet, chat. Oh, barely missing that fair right there for Shiro. Yeah, just like that, man, Glorify has the lead. It is amazing that they managed to find their way back in so many games. I've seen it happen a number of times. Um, really, really impressive. Let's see if Glorify can fight his way back and not able to early kill from Shiro. Both stocks now early kills from um, from Shiro, man. Looking really tough for Glorify to come back from that. Alright, All right, let's see if we get some big damage for Glorify. Not too bad. We gotta find the kill. That is the key when it comes to Morty. Um, finding a kill and let's see will that do it not quite it oh the up air barely misses right there and we got rage mode on shiro barely missing the up air again for Gorify and shiro racking up this damage pushing their advantage state okay good use getting rid of the grenade right there with that down special from shiro I'm just Gorify struggling to get the kill right there right here rage mode Really paying a big impact. Sarah, one, two, will do it. Gorify at 73%. This is absolutely doable. All right, they get off me with the Raven right now. We got the Blaster, some combos. We got the damage racking up 20% on Shiro. 
Glorify playing around the Raven really well right now. Up tilt. Barely missing right there. Glorify continuing to rack up the damage, fighting their way back into this game. Great spacing around the dirt right there from Shiro. All right. Glorify trying to space as much as possible, maintain that distance so he can connect with his projectiles. Unfortunately, Shiro able to enter pretty consistently and Glorify in burnout, not looking great for him off stage here. So they're using the ship to stall, using the grenade as well. Bur Dodge meter is back, and they have a bit of advantage state right now. Shiro only with one bar of dodge meter. Let's see if Gorify can take a game, man, and push this to a game three. Oh, and the Plumbus Yay! grenade. What a confirm. Beautiful from Gorify wow. to take that game, man. Gorify died at, what, 60% and, like, 80% the first two stocks and still manages to take that game. Really, really impressive from Gorify right there, man. Wow. Incredible play. Plumbus into grenade. Quick explosion will kill. Leading into game three here, chat. This is definitely going to be a spicy one. Both characters, both players trying to adapt to one another. Both having gotten one up on the other so far, but this is the match that matters. Absolutely, it's a very, very exciting one. Um, so the winner of this as well, it is 1-1 one, one right now. The winner of this goes on to play Gurfquake, who barely beat Wavy 2-1 in winner's uh, in winner's quarters, so that should be a very very exciting match. Then we also got Karmers versus Oog, so I'm gonna try and get most of the winner's quarters matches on stream. So let's hop into this game three right now. Early lead for Gorify. Nothing that uh, Raven cannot make up though. Do we want Oog waiting here, Behans? Uh, yes, absolutely. Yes, please, Oog. Well, you have it right there, Oog. All right, it's 66%, 2-0 right now for Glorify. It seems like he figured something out about how to deal with Raven. Great down special though to get rid of that grenade. Up tilt will come back down, landing right on Morty's head right there. Sair into almost another Sair. Glorify looking super convincing in this first stock. Let's see if Shiro can turn it around like he did in the last game. Oh, oh, barely missing. Managed to get the up air and allowing Shiro to enter rage state. Not going to be looking good for him. All right, looking good for Glorify. Wow, not able to get the nair right there. Shiro having one bar of dodge meter, getting a hit, earning a little bit of a back, burning it all right there to go for the Sair. Can Glorify take advantage? Yes, he can. Taking that wow. stock. A lead for Glorify, man. He is really, really good at adapting. We've seen it time and time again. He can be down, but he's never out with Morty, man. There's that evil Morty difference. And getting Lenore set up. Let's see. Getting some combos. Going for the neutral special. Let's see. Not able to get a follow up there. Sair to Sair. Going for the up tilt. Not quite Ooh. getting the kill. Another up tilt. Platform blocking it, though. Ooh, misreading the tech right there. But looking really, really good for Glorify still. Getting a ton of extra credit here on Shiro's second stock. Glorify managing to stay alive at 100, which is not easy to do with Morty. However, I may have spoken too soon. I will be sure with the first stock of his own. But uh, Morty looking to take the second one here. Tell you what, though, the difference, the thing I'm keeping an eye on is a couple more percent for Raven, and we get the rage mode just like that. We have it activated. Can we get actual usage off this. Morty gets the kill right there. I was gonna say Morty can struggle to kill at times, but you gotta find the kill at the perfect percent when Raven gets her rage mode and Glorify does just that. Right, we got a lot of ground for Shiro to try and make up right now. Shiro's definitely capable, but it's not gonna be easy with how is playing. He's playing really, really good on this Morty. Doing a great job at spacing, doing a great job at entering. Alright. Almost a whole stock lead for Glorify. It is not looking good for Shiro. This Morty is just playing phenomenal right now. But we got Lenore out. Let's see if we have any good Lenore setups. There's the neutral special, but nothing off of it. Getting there into Sair. 
Can we get the kill right here? Doesn't look like he'll get it. Mori entering back off stage and he will kill with dirt to up air. Keeping Gorify in winner's bracket and sending Shiro into losers. Huge, huge win for Gorify, man. It looked really rough for him after that first game and even the second game. And still he managed to find a way to pull it out. Gorify is so impressive to watch, man. I do hate to see the Raven lose. I can't lie, but Morty and this Go and Gorify is just unbelievable to watch, man. Really, really impressive. Big fan of what I've seen out of Gorify. So that 